It's officially spooky season, bitch. What is up, beautiful people, and welcome back to my YouTube channel that I only post on like once a year. It's whatever. We're trying to figure out life right now. Um, if I look a little busted, I've been at work. I've been running my ass off, waitressing, living the dream. And I'm finally starting off my Halloween series. So, okay, you can probably tell by the caption what this video is going to be. I'm starting this off with a video that I filmed last year for Halloween. Never uploaded it because I'm stupid. But here it is. Um, so don't judge me because I've already come a long way since that video. And I've watched it back and there's so many things that I wish I did differently but I didn't. It is what it is. So, okay. So, without further ado, I think this is, that's all I need to say before you guys watch this video because I'm like low-key scared. I'm gonna shut the fuck up now. Watch me transform into Ariana Grande, Dangerous Woman, Tour Era, Be Alright, Costume, Extravaganza. Okay, let's go. Bye! This is basically like baller on a budget kind of costume because I had a lot of these products already and I only went out and bought a few selective items um, and it really didn't cost me like anything because I, like I said I already had a lot of um, the things. Um, so honestly the costume probably could have you know turned out even cooler if I had went out and splurged on a couple of like different things but I'm really happy with how it turned out so I hope you guys really enjoy this video and if you want to see me transform into Miss Grande, then keep on watching. Okay, so this segment is just me showing you everything that I'm using to create this look. Um, some of the things I could not find um, linked anywhere, so I just linked things below in the bio of things that are similar to these items. That's why some of the pricing is weird because I've had a lot of these things for a while, so you won't find the exact item, but I found things similar, so enjoy for that. So then this is just me showing you how I'm going to layer that on top of the shirt. The hairpins, another good thing, of an example that you can't find anywhere. So I linked something similar below. And then this is me showing you the skirt. I forgot to show it before I cut it in the middle like how her skirt is. But it was just a skirt that was closed in the middle. And I decided to cut it. And that's me showing you what it looks like before I started sewing the edges to make it look a little more um, official. Uh, you could probably find a skirt that might already look like this. But I... I already had this so I figured I would just sew it and try my best and this is just me showing you me cutting it yeah so very DIY of me me showing the back of the skirt is basically what it looked like in the front before I cut it open um, and in the clips of me wearing the skirt I actually am wearing black Spanx under there she wears like a leotard like a bodysuit so I um, recommend getting one of those if you can to wear like as the actual suit underneath but I didn't have that so this is just me sewing and making do with what I have so this is a band I got from Joanne Fabrics it's like an elastic band and it's supposed to go around my waist like a belt so I'm showing you the velcro pieces I'm using to keep it around my waist and I decided to sew it on there because I figured glue wouldn't hold it tightly around my waist the way I would like so that is what I'm doing and ignore my dirty carpet and all these scenes um it doesn't look like that anymore I promise <laughs> Okay, so then we're jumping right into the makeup part. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory for her makeup. She doesn't wear um, like a crazy amount to where you can tell really what she's wearing, but I focus mainly on the brows, so just do your normal face routine, if you will. Um, I look most... There's Michael. <laughs> I look most like her when I don't try, in my opinion, so that's just me with my normal face routine and then the eyebrows, which I was drawing in and taking forever on and trying to get the perfect straight shape. And then I just did a really normal um, soft glam eye with a lot of neutral colors, as you could see from the palette that I used. And then a typical like winged eyeliner, like nothing really crazy at all because any other eye look would not look like hers on me at all. This barely looks like hers on me sometimes, so this is just what we're going with. Yeah, and honestly, you guys, you could just glue down your eyebrows if you really need to for her eyebrows. I think I'm going to try that for this year's look, but as of right now, this is just what I did. And then I'm just trying to really round out my lips and make them look a lot fuller because I have no lips to my face. 
So this is me attempting to make her lips, but my lips are really freaking uneven, so it looks crazy as hell. And then this is me creating her dimples. This is, um, uh, fuck, what's the word? Um, optional if you want to do it. Fuck. <laughs> okay, jumping into hair. I clearly didn't blend down the back of my neck. We're not going to talk about it. But this is me just pulling my hair as tight as, I, yeah, it's a workout, as possibly I can. I can get it tighter now this year. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking, thinking that this was tight enough, but it's not. So you'll see me using a lot of hair gel, bobby pins to try and keep it in place. Um, it wasn't a good look. We're not going to talk about it. It is what it is. But that's me pulling all my hair into place and then I'm going to wrap it into a bun because the ponytail I used was a drawstring, which I prefer better than a wrap ponytail. You'll see what I mean in a second. And then I'm going to spray my hair with the dark hair color. Okay, enjoy. I will say you guys be very careful during this part because it ended up splatter painting all over my face and like the back of my neck when doing this part. It was really tricky trying to get my hairline so I go in with eyeshadow afterwards. You'll see what I mean in a second but I end up getting it like everywhere. Okay, I'm doing a drawstring this year for my ponytail too. Um, it's actually a different ponytail because I'm psycho and I bought a different one and, and it's longer and I'm psycho. Okay, bye. Um, in case anyone's wondering what I just did, I put the ponytail piece over my bun and then I take the string and you wrap it around, which you already saw me do, and then you pull it tight and you bobby pin it into place and then you'll grab a piece of hair to kind of cover that to make it look more natural. Um, I didn't use a big enough piece, so it still kind of looks a little wonky, but I thought it turned out pretty good for, like, my first time really trying. And then I made any touch-ups, which was making myself look more tan and fixing my face makeup after the splatter paint issue. Adding my accessories, which included just a diamond earring. <laughs> And then this is me just filling in my hairline with eyeshadow. Oh my god. Um, I don't know what was all over me. I apologize. I'm stupid as hell. This year, I will not let anything be all over me. I promise. <laughs> Um, I would normally show you how I do the tattoos, but I'm going to have help when I go to work tonight because I can't do the ones on my neck. I've tried, but I cannot do them. And then I'll just do the ones on my fingers then as well because I don't want to ruin them because I'm going to go do some stuff. So I hope my eyebrows are good enough. They are when I do certain faces and then when you're up close, but I don't know. I'm still trying to figure out the eyebrows. I can touch it up when I go to work, so yeah. Little close up action. Yep, I'm trash. Um, a little close up action on the glam, the accessories, minus the tattoos. And that is it, sis. Me trying to look like her for like 10 minutes straight. Sick. Okay. <laughs> ah, alrighty. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. It's probably really cringy. Whatever. In a year difference, things change so much. But I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also, don't forget to check me out on all my socials. I'm also doing TikTok now. <laughs> it was good. I'm so stupid. Yeah, we knew. And my crusty, dusty, like, chicken nugget fingers. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs> oh my god, I just forgot everything in my world. And until next time, stay happy. <laughs> Let's 
day. I can't stop. Oh my God, the camera turns on and I just like, <laughs> like a, ooh. stay confident and stay humble. Uh -huh.